Well, the cats have changed position. Here is Bebe, and there is Petra. How funny is that? So look at, look at, she wags her tail like a dog. She was raised with dogs. She was raised with uh, Lilu and Coco. Coco uh, was Lilu's mom. She passed away December of this year. 20, oh no, 2022, so December last year. So we are almost at the 4th of July. But I think it's hilarious how she wags her tail like a dog. Look at her. It's just because my, my cat. So I'm happy because she's wagging her tail and she's happy. So here they are in the in the window display here. I am so happy because she's been, Beb has been outside ever since these cats came. And it's been a couple of months. I would guess around April maybe. April, May, June, July. Maybe. I'll have to see. I was doing my live streams every morning and when these cats came I couldn't do it anymore because they're so loud and in the beginning they needed a lot of attention and there she is with her tail. So I'm glad, like I said, I'm glad that she is happy, that Bebe is happy and I moved her water to the floor. I had the water there at the top and now here they are just doing what cats do oh she's so happy look at this she's happy girl and i'm glad that she came to this corner to the corner where i am where my sewing machine is at and they are just content they are a content happy as can be and she caught the spot I guess this one here, closer to me, is the spot. <laughs> Look at her. Oh, you're so sweet, baby. You're happy, baby. I'm glad that you're here with me, spending this quality time with my cats. And I can't tell you how happy I am that that baby is here. I mean, I don't like it when she's outside. She's outside in... in during the day, the night, it was raining. She was still outside. She wouldn't want, want to come inside. We were having those April showers, the May showers. And right now is the first hot day in the morning, maybe around two in the morning. There was a small earthquake. And here, oh, let's see what they do. She decided to come over here. So in this morning, we had a small earthquake on the ocean, on the Pacific Ocean. I think it was a 3.8. But I wanted to get their reaction here. She wants to come here near her, but I'm glad. They're tolerating, well, Bebe. Bebe's tolerating them. And that is Petra, the sweet one. And she stopped moving her tail as much. Let me show you. She's moving it, but not as much as before. And all these little things are my stuff. My shoes, my socks, my stuff for the dolls. Oh, she's relaxing now. Look at her. I'm so happy. I'm trying to adjust over here. And there is Petra, and she's she just said, this is my spot. You hear her? Uh, be quiet so you can hear her. That's me adjusting the uh, lighting. Oh, poor Petra. She's such a sweetheart. She knows that she, that they uh, invaded her, her home. But it wasn't their fault. They're just trying to get along. The Sphinx cats, they're just, they're so lovable. They, they require a lot of attention, a lot of my cuddles, a lot of my time. And in a way, that's what uh, Bebe, my black and white cat got. Bebe was a foster. I was weaning her. She was a tiny, tiny baby. And she was the only cat. I don't know the story 
and we were we were bottle feeding her she was so tiny and I have this one picture on my old Facebook where I had Bebe and my, my dog Lilu and they were best friends I have pictures over there so some way somehow I'm gonna try to see if I can go in there and get them screenshot them and, and show them but I am in no hurry to go back to Facebook it's such a mess there with all the you know all the stuff all the posts uh, all the commercials so let's talk about something fun something nicer so she came back to her spot and she basically is standing her ground here and saying this is my corner and that is for a Sunday afternoon spending quality time with my pets Lilu's here by my side oh she went to her bed oh she's gonna leave there she goes did you hear that thud they are so they look light but they're really heavy they're very heavy maybe it's because they don't have the puff ball of the like Bebe here like a typical cat but they're very very heavy all right that will be all for today thanks for joining me if I hope to be able to do more of these videos like I said this is the very first time that they are literally in the same room and very happy about that and yeah that way baby doesn't get uh, too thrashed outside by the weather we'll see you in the next video I am looking forward to doing more sewing uh, Tuesday is the 4th of July, so I am done sewing 4th of July, and what does that mean? I will start officially the kickstart of my Halloween sewing. Halloween sewing for my dolls, Halloween sewing for people. I've already started putting in sneak peeks, and I will start listing at my coffee shop, and within a week, I will open up the commissions. We'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye. Hi, sweetie. Hi, baby.